Hello, this is a video about catalysts. Catalysts speed up chemical reactions. Let's start off by looking at an example. Here is a conical flask that contains hydrogen peroxide. Hydrogen peroxide goes through a chemical reaction to break down into water and oxygen. It does it by itself, but it does it very slowly. We can see how fast or slow this happens by measuring the amount of oxygen that's given off. So we can set up the apparatus like this. The tube leads into a basin of water that has an upside down measuring cylinder which is also filled with water. As the oxygen is produced, the oxygen gas that's collected here will cause the water level to go down. Because this reaction is quite slow, you might just notice that the oxygen levels are increasing and the water level is going down, but very slowly. You might just notice that. What we can do is add a catalyst to make this reaction go faster. Here is our catalyst. This is something called manganese dioxide. It's a black powder. We don't need to worry too much about the name. Just the idea that it's a catalyst that can speed up this reaction. Once we add this catalyst, the reaction goes much faster. Look how much more quickly the oxygen is produced and how much more quickly the water level goes down. This is because we added a catalyst. The catalyst made the reaction go much faster. So catalysts speed up chemical reactions. However, there is one more thing about them. If we empty out the hydrogen peroxide and rinse and filter the manganese dioxide, so in other words, we get the catalyst back. We get the catalyst back by filtering and rinsing it. We can add some fresh hydrogen peroxide and we can use the catalyst again. So we refill it add some fresh hydrogen peroxide and the reaction goes again. The catalyst can be used over and over again. It's not used up in the chemical reaction. So this is the key thing about catalysts. They speed up reactions and they can be used over and over again. So let's summarize what we've just gone through. So this is all about catalysts. And the first thing is, they are substances that speed up reactions. Substances that speed up reactions. They are not used up in the reaction. So they can be used as a catalyst over and over again. They don't take part in the reaction. And this is something we haven't covered yet. They work by lowering the energy needed to start a reaction. We call that the activation energy sometimes. And they do this by often by providing a surface for the chemicals to meet. If the chemicals in the reaction meet or attach to the catalyst, the reaction can go a bit faster. And they are used a lot in manufacturing chemicals. They are used a lot to manufacture chemicals. That means making those chemicals is cheaper. Reaction goes faster and we get more of it. And usually one catalyst will speed up one particular kind of reaction. So these are the key points of catalysts. Just there at the top, I've just put what some catalysts look like. They're just small pieces and fragments of different materials. But that's the key idea behind catalyst. Thanks for watching and I'll see you soon.